na 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 Good morning and happy March 2nd! <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> really slowly and so, a time lapse so that I looked like I was walking normally. <laughs> he was literally walking like, like this. <laughs> like. <laughs> so slow. It took me like five minutes to walk up to the camera. Yeah. <laughs> took some Polaroids, but you look like you hate me. Can we take some more? <laughs> Truth is, he does hate me. Just went to Brandy and Urban and I got a couple things that I've been like eyeing and I just haven't been getting because I'm like, hey, I have to stop spending money, but I like I thought about it, you know? You like it? Not full I know. You're missing like this part. I know. But it's cute, right? Yeah, it's like... <laughs> hey! We just called a new one. I really wanted, like really quick, I wanted to show you guys what I got um, when we were shopping. Um, Obviously, went to Trader Joe's. All the bags are in there. And I got some groceries, but that's boring. I don't want to show you guys that. I went to Brandy, and look at this, girl. This. Off the shoulder top. I thought it was super cute. I love off the shoulder tops and this is, it reminds me of like Greece, you know? And I'm planning on going to Santorini with my friend. So I think it would be like really cute to wear and it was $25. And then, girl, look at this yellow Urban Outfitters bag. When I saw it, I was like, to the worker, I was like, they have yellow bags now. Now I have a pink and yellow bag and I'm like, why are you that like I'm so annoying? I love it. Um, so I got Urban Outfitters, I got two things. And I thought that they were like decently priced. I got, this is like just a plain shirt and it comes with a blue one and a white one. And for two shirts, it was $20. I thought it was good for Urban because usually they're like so expensive. But it's like that oversized kind of look. I don't know if you can see, but I thought it'd be cute. Like tucked in some jeans, I thought it'd be cute. And I got these glasses. They're not prescription or anything. They're just like fashion glasses and they were $14. And they remind me of Tess Christine. I remember the size of Tess Christine. Okay, is it over here? Love, do you hate me? Do you hate me? Yeah? Okay. I love you. <laughs> okay, we're going to the gym now. I just finished up at the gym and we did quite a bit. I said we're, we mainly like focus on abs because I was like, I want a bigger one. And she was like, okay. So we did abs and like um, butt. And she said like, girl, if you want to have a bigger butt, you have to have like a toned tummy. And I was like, I agree. So we did all of these. Hello. 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 All of these. And I can show you guys all of it when I get to, what do you call it? The apartment. I can't even see. I don't think I can come here. So Who thinks that I can be more fit than Matt? Okay. I think I'm gonna be. Cause I go to the gym like every single week with a personal trainer. Hmm? Once Even a week. Even though you're like a firefighter. But like, Once I- Once a week. I'm like a, the hardcore gymnast, dude. I'm protein, dude. No, you don't. Yeah, dude, dude. I eat omega-3 vitamins, dude. Yeah, bro. You go once a week and you think you're huge. <laughs> I am huge. So here's the fitness part of today's video. So basically, we did 15 reps of the pelvic bridge with a barbell. So that's basically like you get like a weight right here, and I think I did like 20 or something. And then you go like this, and you like squeeze your butt. And I did that 15 times, um, three times, so three sets. And then we did the kickbacks. And that was with 7.5 pounds. And we did that 15 times, three times. So that's basically, we went on this machine. I connected my leg to it and I went like this. But she said to actually keep my leg bent for most of it. So it was like that. And we switched to the other side. And then squat jumps. 
that killed me. We did fifth, or no, we did 12, three, three times, yeah. So squat jumps are like this. <laughs> you just squat and then jump and then that 15 times, three times, boy. And then this says ab incline. So basically we did that 15 times, three times. There's a trend with that. Basically I just hung on to like the rug or like the mat and I went like this 15 times. Sorry if I'm like so awkward when I do it. I'm like not a fitness pro at all, but <laughs> these are like some things that you guys can do like just at your house and you don't really need a machine for. Um, so that's what I did today. And I also did like, I think it was 10 minutes on the stair machine. So girl, if you're at your house, just run up and down the stairs for like 10 minutes. <laughs> well, don't run. I did like um, 60 steps per minute. So it was like pretty slow. You know what I'm saying? So that's what I did. <laughs> that was in my gym. Um, well, I gym. Yeah. Now Matt's taking a shower and I'm gonna go shower after and we're gonna get ready to go to the Toronto Maple Leafs game. They're versing LA and it's in LA, it's in downtown. So we wanna get there a little bit early and we can maybe get like some, you know, merch, some hockey merch. <laughs> and uh, we have our jerseys, so we're gonna wear our Toronto jerseys. We're gonna be that annoying, like that annoying person that is on the opposite side and like cheers for the opposite team the away team But it's gonna be fun. I think it'll be fun ah! Damn it. I to scare you, but you didn't even get scared well, that was horrible. For the mess in the background, but this is my gym outfit of the day. I got this little what do you call it windbreaker from forever 21 i got this calvin klein shirt from kevin glenn you know and these leggings are from blagaletis and it has a matching bra <laughs> my stomach ew and i have my nikes these are the ones that i got with Haley in new york if you want to shop blagaletis and you think that you're like the same size as me i'm a size six in bras and a size four in leggings maybe a size six in leggings but that's those are my sizes Yes, today I wore some eyelashes that were not the Kiss number 11s, and I don't like them. They're like, I don't even know what they are. The only thing is like, it, I don't know. They're just not the Kiss ones. I love the Kiss 11s. They're my favorite eyelashes ever. We need to clean up. <laughs> Can I show you guys my new- <laughs> Ah! Stop! I hate you! Can I show you guys my new closet? Well, it's not new. I just like filled it up so it looks way different. This is my closet stop it love you're so annoying I didn't do anything. yeah you did I didn't, I this is my new closet well my attic closet i have my hats all over here and i got this hat rack from bed bath and beyond i want to get another one for the other side so that you know it looks it looks cool and i have some extra hats over there that i want to hang up too so on this side this is where I keep my Starburst, um, some PR packages. Over here are some bathing suits. Over here are some socks, some underwears. That's really gross. <laughs> my gross underwears uh, from like grade eight. Um, here's some. I still have them. <laughs> I have some leggings and bras and shorts, um, some casual tops some workout tops um workout tops some shorts like normal like jean shorts here's some pajamas and then here's where i keep my jackets here's my cookie monster onesie oh yes girl and then here's some more jackets over here my extra hats disney this is for when i go to disney i still have yet to go but i'm gonna go hopefully with my manager and my full screen managers you're such a butt cheek. How? You just are. Just sitting on the bed. Just. Well. Just being a butt cheek. <laughs> Here is where I keep my receipts. Here is my bathrobe. And this is my little Tinkerbell purse. There's my. Um, electronics. I don't know where to put my electronics, so I kinda like shoved it over here. Oh no! Um, here's my hamper. Um, some randomness over here, some belts, some chokers, um, I have some more chokers in my bathroom though. Um, here's where I keep my shoes, my favorite part of my closet. 
I have my high heels in the top, some more running shoes. I didn't realize how many running shoes I had until I all put them together. And then some over here, because they didn't all fit. But that's my closet. Closet tour. Um, how do I make it look cool? Ah. <laughs> Maple Center. A million years of driving later. We made it. We're going to watch Toronto Maple Leafs versus LA Kings, right? Yeah. Yes. Look at Mr. Snapchatter photographer over here, over in here. What happens at the Leaf games when like people are wearing different jerseys? <laughs> what happens? Like, like they get screamed at. <laughs> yeah, but the little kid had a Leaf jersey. Yeah, but he, he has a little kid. <laughs> He's good. I'm, I'm grown. I'm grown. I can be a little kid. All right, where do we Aww. enter? I'm his little sister. <laughs> okay. Look at that little guy. He has the Leafs jersey. See? Okay. What do you want to do first? You want to eat? No, I want to look at the shop. This guy wants to get some merch, bro. You want some LA Kings merch, bro? Are we going, Mar bro? Oh, we're going here? Oh, they have cheerleaders. We don't have cheerleaders. Cheerleaders? I don't think we have cheerleaders. You're getting a jersey, even though you're already wearing a jersey, bro. Come on, bro. Uh, no, bro. The stick, bro. Getting a stick, bro. Oh, for your dad, bro. Right, bro? <laughs> nice, bro. Let's see our seats. Yeesh, it's cold. Whoa. Way better than the ACC. Whoa. They have a Canadian flag. Los Angeles Kings. Yeesh. Attention, love. We're near all the Toronto fans. Woo. Okay. Snapchatting the game, bro. Yeah, bro. Screens inside of the screen. Canadian like Toronto fans than I thought that there would be. And I met a subscriber and she's from Toronto. I was like, I put her on my Snapchat. now so unfortunately like all greats do we have lost the game in the shootouts and that was your first shootouts ever right yep 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 matt thinks that he's cooler than me and can get past me with, by duking me I but he can't. I can't i'm a literal brick wall and i'm, I'm one foot shorter than him on a football field but so much more jacked oh. look at look at look at <gasps> oh yeah Oh yeah, but I'm gonna show them. We set up Netflix. So we put the couch over here, and because it, it used to be over there, put it over here, and then we set up the projector, and we're watching Suits right now to get all caught up. And Chloe's coming home today, so we're so excited. And I think I'm gonna end the vlog here. What should the tip of the day be, love? Every task we complete, every obstacle we overcome, and every goal we reach gives us a sense of self-accomplishment and self-reliance. So even though we did lose today, we did score two goals. And hey! 
Oprah Winfrey was fired at her job at 23. Steve Jobs was fired from Apple, the company that he co-founded. His second act turned out to be bigger and better than the first. And Walt Disney's newspaper editor told him that he wasn't creative enough. So no matter what, the, everyone that succeeds fails. And if you're ever in like a poopy mood, you feel like everything that you do sucks, everyone's been through it. And you'll get through it, and you're amazing, and I love you guys so much, and ah, my pimple! <laughs> Concealer can only do so much. Okay, bye. You have to go through struggles to be the person that you're destined to be.